Hey, what's up, y'all? Just wanted to go over this new AP2 safety filter with using my F1 Ultra. I have it set up in my studio. Uh, we're just going to do some slate coaster engraving first. We're going to do a deep embossment because that typically was very dusty, and uh, I had issues with that exhausting before. But as you can see here, we're just I'm just showing you quickly like what the filter conditions are prior to, and then we'll go ahead and start this embossing. So I have the filter set to automatic, which is awesome because it automatically kicks on um, as needed uh, throughout the process. So it'll stay on and it'll suck all of those exhaust fumes out and all of that uh, that dust. So it's very safe to use inside the house or at shows, which is what I will be using it for. So we're going to go ahead and get that started. I'm going to go ahead and have this sped up currently, but I'm just showing you that it's going to be sucking all of those fumes right out that exhaust port. Now that's currently sped up, but what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna slow it down so you can see it in real time. So this is the laser actually going, taking all of that uh, slate dust and there's nothing going anywhere else. As you can see, I just have that hooked up right there and it's just, it, I don't even have the lid closed and it's still doing it. You can see this cool little cyclone, this first cyclone pre-filter at the top. It's gonna get a lot of that large debris this way. It doesn't end up in your filters and clogging those up right away. Just to show you guys, that's that was real time. Now we're going to go ahead and skip to some quicker engraving just to finish that up so I can show you. And then I'm going to have it do some more passes. We'll cut that out, save you guys the time. But I just like to make it white. This way it kind of really pops. And then uh, here you'll see the end result. So that's the embossing engraving. Now we're going to go ahead and move on to some wood. Because wood, typically when you burn it, there's a lot of smoke. So again, I'll show you. Now we have 100% on our filter still. We'll go ahead and process. Sorry, part of that's a cutoff in the top right. I didn't get the whole screen. We'll go ahead and hit start. We'll watch that. This is sped up. But as you can see, that smoke's going right out the back into that filter system. So there's zero fumes inside my house. There's nothing at all for smell. Then I always wanted to show you guys like how it would look like if we did like a cut even. And even with the cut, you could see that there's a little bit of flame, but it's there's so much uh exhaust going out that it kind of sucks all that right out along with the smoke and as you can see here cut right through no problem um, this was just a test board that i had so i cut through that three millimeter basswood and now i'm going to show you guys like what the filters look like coming straight out after all of that got a little stuck there trying to do that one-handed but as you can see there's just a little dust on there Nothing crazy. Those are all washable. You can go ahead and wash that right off. And then the second filter, you just see just a little dust on that pre-filter. And that's really all to be said. There's nothing much on the HEPRA filter at all. But yeah, I just want to show you guys this is an awesome filter. And I can't wait to take it to like events with me. Or just use it inside the house. I mean, it seems like it's going to be great for that too.